All right, let's do this. Give me you, you rolling here. Hmm. I'll take pan. Hmm. Whetstone. What I'm doing is super risky. I can't start the game off with a 1.6 cooldown, can I? I mean, I could sell this garlic and just go for this banana, right? I have that luxury low key. I think that's what I'll do. Uh... Okay, that works. That will work. Don't know how good or smart this is. <laughs> this will work. Okay, it seems like we're fine. Never mind. I think I got crit for like 12. All right, which means we need another banana. Oh. Game hates me. Um, damn, the game hates me. The game hates me. I need a banana. I need like three of them in order to rock this sword with this pan. Because it just takes up way too much stamina. Well, I might beat this person, actually. Okay, cool. We beat this person. Great. Hey, and we got another banana. Even better. A pan on sale, imagine. Roll. Another weddy? I say we take. We take, get the combination. I'd rather, like, <laughs> I guess I could just move this. And, oh, I did not want to do that. How did we have it? Something like this. Boom, 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 boom. Um, and I guess we could just do this for both of those touching. And then heat generation, just like that. And more space. Okay, we got two bananas this time. Oh, one of the white stones isn't touching the pan. I guess it's... Well, it's not ideal. But maybe it'll be okay. Can I win? Let's go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh. Okay. 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 Okay, we can do this. We can certainly do this. Um, yeah, we can certainly do this. Let's get you. Sell a flame, get some space and Um, wait, here we go. Oh, that is better. Kind of ish. I need to upgrade this uh, into a flame sword. Um. Unless I move this somewhere else, like over here, maybe like there. No. Okay, this has potential. This has potential. Like this. All three foods are touching you. Those are touching each other. Okay, cool. We'll, we'll rock with this. This will work. I'm gonna get this other banana. But yeah, this will work. This will work. Okay. This build has potential. I see the future potential in this build and I am excited for it. If I can make it work, that would be wonderful. Okay, beautiful. Okay, let me do... I'm gonna do this dagger. Oh, I could go with, I could go with molten daggers. I didn't even think about molten daggers. All right, we're going with dagger and stamina sack. 
definitely stamp sack. I'm gonna do something like this. That looks good. I should probably go with a molten dagger here. So let's do this. Cause with the pumpkin, you know, the chance, uh, the chance to stun is massive. Do I need this other banana? What's my stamina? 1.5? I'm gonna get it for good luck, and I also need to get that Excalibur. I need to get that Excalibur ASAP. I think we win this. Or maybe not? Hello? Oh, come on. Freaking poison, man. That's fine, though, because now we have Molten Dagger, which is great. I'm gonna get you. I'm not gonna get you yet. I need that stamina. Stamina. Oh, I need heat generation too. Let's get space. But yeah, I definitely need that heat. Um, I'm just gonna move this there. Or I can move you up and move everything over by one. That would work. And that way I can fit more heat items inside of the fire pit. Okay, in the next round, we're going to get the chili pepper. And then we're going to get the Excalibur. Hopefully, we're going to get the stamina potion. They don't have mana generation, which is a good thing for me. Looks like they're going for claws of attack and the spike shield or spike uh, staff. But it doesn't seem like there's anything we need to worry about because they just don't have mana generation. Beautiful. Boom. Let's go. And you're giving me a mana orb. Oh my gosh. It's going to actually happen. This is going to actually happen. Um, I need more daggers. I need more daggers. I need more chilies. I need more mana generation from the mana orb. And everything will be right within the world. Especially if I can win this. But I'm going against a chili goober though. Which is dangerous. I mean, he's only got one DPS, which is the Burning Sword. Our DPS is higher, but he's faster, which is a problem. Plus, the spikes is scary as well. Looks like we're going to be fine, though. Okay. Awesome. Ding! Let me get that Crusader on sale. Boom, boom. Let's roll it here. And I say we just get Potion Belt just for space. Because we're going to need space, right? So, let's see here. Let's reset. How do we want this to be set up? Don't know yet. Cause I know I want the Excalibur to be inside of uh, inside of the fanny pack. Uh, honestly, Burning Sword doesn't necessarily have to be next to Excalibur. I feel like our main DPS is gonna come from our Molten Daggers. That's where most of our DPS is gonna come from. I mean, it doesn't hurt having it next to Excalibur, right? Because it's not like we have enough food anyways. We don't have no food. <laughs> Realistically. I say we need to max out this mana orb as much as we can. And that's probably just going to come from our weapons. More than likely. That's five second cooldown. I mean, it is food. So I guess we'll just go with Burning Banner. And like this has activators. That's taking up a lot of slots for... Uh, For food slots though, so we're gonna have to change this around some whenever we get to that point. But for now, it'll be okay. Um, let's go boom. So we don't really need stamina. We're at a one point, whatever that number was. <laughs> so we really don't need stamina. So I guess, it, well, I, I guess for the, the damage numbers, it's probably better to do this. Or maybe even move this over by one and put a banana right there and do something like, uh, maybe move this over by one like that. That's probably the best right there. Okay, that works. We're gonna have to move this situation a lot eventually, but we need more chilies. We need more mana generation, blueberries, 
mana orbs, daggers. We're gonna need a lot of everything for this to fully work. We're probably gonna lose this though. Yeah. Just get spikes more than likely, right? I don't know, the blue, well, I guess it benefits from that. Let's get, honestly, bro, I say we get a Dracunic Orb. Just so we can combat people that are rocking spikes. And we can get an extra dagger, which is good too. More spaces and everybody. Plus a Dracunic Orb can be an activator, like over this dagger. Something like this. But then again, I need the dagger next to the burning sword. You know what I mean? So I guess we'll have to keep it like that. And we also got to upgrade this dagger as well. Um, how do we want to do this? I guess we could just replace that. Um, let's see here. Boom, boom. Maybe like this instead. Or maybe not. I'm gonna figure it out. I'm gonna figure it out, guys. Or... Yeah, double heat. Hmm. Okay, that works better. Um, I, I mean, this isn't bad though. Apart from this guy are not really doing much. It's still not bad though. All right, we'll roll with this. This isn't bad though. I'm also gonna get that. I can get you now, I'm gonna get you now. I do need more mana generation though. But at least we got another dagger and we don't have to worry about spikes as much, at least because we have Jakuna Gorb. Nice. Blueberry, that's big. I kind of want to get me another orb, honestly. If I could get me another orb, that would be great. Getting this on sale is kind of nice too. I need space for it though. I'm gonna get this. Okay. Got some more space, a little bit more space. This isn't horrible. I think I'm gonna put you right there. Hmm, then do this. But then again, the orb has to go here. I guess the double hit with the pumpkin makes the Molten Daggers trigger faster. Essentially. Probably faster than the Burning Banner on its own as a trigger. Because this is every 3.2, this is every 3.5, but it triggers twice with the pumpkin, right? So that's probably a better activator. And that means we can really just put this Burning Banner anywhere we want. And this can turn sideways, which means then we do something like that. Um, even better. Maybe even do something like this, since we have a new blueberry in town. That can go there. Um, and then we just have heat items in there. Okay. Okay, this works. Need more mana generation. Lacking on mana a lot, but it'll be okay, I think, I hope. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, wait till I get that mana generation up. Wait till I get that mana generation up. I'm gonna go ahead and buy this so I can stop thinking about it. Oh, it gave me a chili. Another freaking chili. That's six. I, oh, I kind of do want a fanny pack right now. I kind of need it. We need the space. We don't really need all these bananas. So I'm gonna sell a banana. And that way I can afford both of those. Okay. Okay, and we're putting one here for that fanny pack. Um, 
And I guess theoretically speaking, we could do this to separate those fanny packs, even though it might not be the best idea in the world. I'll rock with it for now. See if I can make it work. Yeah, something like that. Then again, the shield needs to go somewhere. And that might be a problem. Unless I do this. I mean, that works. And Mr. Shield can go here. I want to turn into a sun shield. That's why I got it. Right. That I'm recording. Bye bye. So the only problem we have now is we have to optimize this because both of these chilies and the burning banner needs to go in here. The only thing I can realistically sacrifice would probably be a banana. That's the only thing I could realistically sacrifice here, I believe. Um, There's got to be something I can do with this guy, maybe. I mean, I could put this here. That just makes this better. Maybe I can, like, do this for some iteration of it in some f way. And that gives me this space to have. Potentially. Maybe boom. I wish I had a protective first to put there. I mean, I could just move this down by one. Instead of trying to suffer <laughs> right there, I guess. What if I were to move this here? That still leaves that just opening, which is kind of annoying. Unless I did that into a blueberry into this. Oh, I'm still missing that. Well, I guess I could put the chili there. And all the food is kind of just like somewhere, right? And then I could, well, no. Well, yeah, that still works. Boom, boom, sun armor. Okay. This works. Yeah, okay, awesome. That works. That actually works. What do we go? Ooh, an OG? OG build? He doesn't have Steel Goober yet. I'm feeling pretty confident in this. I think we'll take this one home. Our mana generation is all oh, our first stamina lock right there, which is insane. <laughs> Ding! Got my sun armor. Whoop whoop. Woobity 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 woobity. I didn't need this. <laughs> but I got it anyways. Um, low key thinking about getting fanfare as well. Seven gold though. We don't really have to manage it. This does generate me mana, but I think I'm gonna pass on it for now. Until I get better mana generation. That orb is exactly what we need. Exactly what we need. Let's get you. Um see here i say we reset let's reset again let's reset again let's reset again okay so fanny we're gonna put one orb um there one orb there now we just need activators or said orbs i guess i could do something like this that kind of makes it a little bit more whole okay so the shield could be an activator, so that's good, at the very least. Um, Burning banner? Well, wait, wait, wait. Boom. Actually, no. Dagger. Dagger. And over here, we could go burning banner. Draconic orb. And that kind of, like, covers all our activators. And now we just need to implement the food items, which... Blueberry. Pumpkin. 
I guess a chili could be a f uh, activator. I don't think it's a better activator than a mana warp though. But I, I mean, I could do like that. I mean, if I can make it work without having to do that, that would be great. But I don't know if I can make it work without having to do that. Maybe if I, uh... Maybe yeah, that's better. And I could do that. I think I'm gonna do this. I mean, I get more damage out of it. Out of the uh, Molten Dagger by having it next to the Burning Sword, right? Even though it's not that big of a damage increase, it's a damage increase nevertheless. Well, I mean, technically speaking, I could just do this. But then what am I putting there? Blueberry? <laughs> this doesn't really matter, huh? I also think it's better if I just put the shield like here. That way it's also touching that extra burning banner. Only issue is the banana isn't on the Excalibur now. Hmm. Unless I put it here and I move this guy up here. It's not the best placement for food. But on the bright side, our mana generation is way better now. So that's good. I'm looking at this Whopper Tinker as well. Just for the stamina. It's on sale. We're going to get a lot of heat and mana. And regeneration and everything like that. And we don't really have to rely on these bananas anymore. I said we get it. Just, just so we don't have to rely on the bananas. As much. You know what I mean? We'll still have to rely on them. Just not as much. Going to get some Phoenix Dark Lantern, dude. Oh, we're doing a way better now. Oh my gosh, we're doing way better now. Now that we got the extra mana, we're doing way better. Don't need any of that. We just bought space. So I'm not really sure if I uh, if I want this potion belt. I'll take it. I'll take it. We didn't really buy anything that round. I'll take it though. I do want more daggers. More daggers, more mana. Emphasis on the mana. Definitely emphasis, emphasis on the mana. Holy sh... Jesus, that stun? He went from like 100 health to zero. Off of that freaking pumpkin stun, bro. Holy moly. Honestly, I don't even think we need Burning Sword anymore. Because the Molten Daggers, they increase their own DPS. Automatically, you know what I mean? And, like, the Burning Sword really doesn't do anything. Except, I mean, it increases the DPS. I mean, I guess gaining. For, I mean, it's a 40% chance, though, of, of, of gaining one heat. Right? So, realistically, like, do I need you here? I'm starting to think I don't. Ooh, what about an obsidian dragon? This would be solid just because it does a lot of DPS. Plus, the cooldown is nice. And I can get it like now. Why? Well, I can get it next round. I mean, if I sell this, it's risky. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. We're selling this. We're buying the ruby egg. Putting you there for now. We did just get another molten dagger, which is beautiful. So, we're gonna be turning you into a real boy. Right over there. I wish I had more mana generation. I wish I had more blueberries, but it's okay. It is okay. Ooh. What the frick? That's a lot of carrots and chili and scariness. It's a lot of scariness. On the bright side, I'm removing his buffs. Which means the carrots really can't give him the empowerment. But at the same time, he's got Molten Dagger. So does he really need the empowerment? But it seems like we're fine. Okay, awesome. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, on sale. Thank you. Oh my gosh. That's all the mana we need. That's literally all the mana we need. Let's buy you for space because we're going to need it. 
And I'm selling one of you to get this orb. All right, looks like we're gonna reorganize once more. Uh, I'm actually gonna move you over as like, not smart as that sounds. <laughs> gonna move you over. And we could put this dagger there. I'm just making sure that everything has somewhat of an activator. I don't know. Uh, maybe I should, uh, maybe I should put the shield there instead. It's probably better. Honestly, I could put a banana here inside of a dagger, but that's not going to be as much mana, is it? We have like no food. <laughs> Um, we barely have any star slots on this freaking egg. But then again, we barely have any food. The only food we're missing is that one singular banana. I think we're fine without that one singular banana. A great sword and spike staff. Oh my gosh, and dear we're guardian. Well, we did just upgrade our mana like a lot. So hopefully that matters a lot. You know what I mean? Seems like it is mattering a lot. Every time we activate, we go right back to seven, which is great. Where's our heat generation though? Where's our heat? Oh, we have no heat generation. Except for the the chilies. But the molten daggers are just eating up all of our heat. We need a lot more chilies. <laughs> we need a lot more chilies. We also need another uh, Dracunic orb. Um. Roll, roll, roll. I'm looking at that thing and I'm like, Ooh. I feel like I should get it. I think I'm gonna get you, actually. I'm gonna get you. I don't know where I'm gonna put you, though. I guess you could go here. It's not, I mean, it's a faster activator than the, the orb is, which is good. Um, dang it. Um, damn, we need more heat generation, bro. The molten daggers are kind of hungry. This is a dangerous build to go against. I think we might lose this. Oh. Oh, I stand corrected. Look at our heat generation. We were actually like there. Sheesh. Burning sword with double molten dragons and a full blown dragon's nest dragon with perfect ruby on the big boy. And you made him faster. What a build that person had. Good game though. Let's get some space. Got another Dracunic orb. I mean, do I really need it now though? Are we really that afraid of spikes? I guess we are because of the molten daggers and a pumpkin. But I kind of want to try rolling just for to get the chilies though. I'm not going to get it. I'll get it. It's on sale. I do not need more mana. I don't think. I need more heat. If anything, I need more heat. Where should I put you? I guess I could do this. That kind of works. Um, that's not bad.
Okay, this works. Everything has an activator. They're pretty fast activators at that, which is good. We got a birdie in here. Okay. Okay. This is looking solid. But most of our heat, honestly, is coming from the burning coals after their uh, after their time limit is up, I'm noticing. It's not really coming from the chilies, even though the chilies do help. Nasty. You know what would be great with this? Vampirism. <laughs> vampirism would be great. I mean, we did get three from uh, Whopper, Whopper Tinger, but Vampirism would be pretty great with this. It would be dope. Good game. Okay, last round. What are we buying? Draconic Orb? No. I don't think so. I want more chilies. How lucky can we get to get a chili? I should probably pick up this Corrupted Crystal, though. And just put it somewhere? It's not gonna go there, but I'm just gonna put it there for now. So I figure out where I really wanted to go. Can I get a fanfare? Should I get a fanfare? Should I get a fanfare? Hell, with mana generation? Let's get a fanfare. And I guess we'll top it off with this guy, maybe? Since we can't get any chilies. Yeah, let's top it off with that guy. Where should you go? It's not gonna be too much of a pain to try to reorganize. Honestly, he might just keep you there. I mean, if I did switch you here, I guess I could put the bird. Nah, that's not good. Well. Let's see. And that way, at least the burning banner is affecting the sun shield and the, uh, the Excalibur at the same time. Which is horrible. But I need a food item to go down here now. Which I guess could be you, and then you could go up here. And that pretty much just works. Okay, that pretty much just works. All right, this is the build. This is the build. We got a pumpkin with triple molten daggers with an obsidian dragon just because. I wish we would've gotten like two more chilies, but I mean, what can you do? We got two chilies here, lots of mana, which is amazing. And we got a freshly new fanfare, which is great. So yeah, what are we going against? Looks like an all spikes build, bro. Tuscan Poker, Tuscan Piercer, Thorn Whip, Triple Heroics, Triple that for no reason, and then four Pineapples, all on a Poison Ivy. All on a freaking Poison Ivy. Let's see how this goes, because that's going to be a lot of Poison, and that's going to be a lot of Spikes that we're going to have to deal with. I'm sad we decided not to go with Dracoonic Aura, because the Spikes is going to be hurting us a lot. Oh, we might actually lose this. Oh! Yeah, we're losing this for sure. Yeah. Unfortunate. That was a good game, though. That was a good game. Dracoonic Orbs, bro. Would have helped us out so much there. We mainly took most of our damage from spikes. Yeah, most of it came from spikes. Just because we were rocking daggers. Unfortunately. Which is okay. It was okay. That was a good game, though. I'll take it. I'll take that game. I like the fact that we... Ah, oh, I forgot to move Corrupt the Crystal somewhere else. But still, I like the fact that we actually utilized Pumpkin with the Molten Daggers. More heat generation would have been a priority there, honestly. But that's fine. That was a good game. I enjoyed myself. That was a good game.